So last night I stayed at Neil's Gap at their bunkhouse. It was great, got some good sleep. And today the goal is to do 11 miles and make it to Low Gap Shelter. shelter. This is about 11.5 miles today and uh, it's pretty tough after Blood Mountain and tomorrow I'm hoping to do 15 but um, I'm supposed to get some rain so might have to go short. So, let's check this out. So it's the morning and I am leaving Low Gap Shelter and hopefully doing 15 miles to Utrey Mountain Shelter. If not, there's a shelter a few miles before that, but I'd like to get a big uphill done so I don't have to do it in the morning. So that's why I'm going the 15. And uh, yeah, let's get this day started. So I've been hiking, I almost did like eight miles or something like that. I'll double check, but I have decided to get off trail and take a long Nero in Hiawassee and stay at the hotel. The weather changed and it has uh, been a slow drizzle. And um, yeah, I don't feel like hiking in it. So I'm gonna go to a hotel room, get some good food and get dried off. So that's the game plan, waiting on the shuttle driver. He'll be here around 12.30. So, the end of my trail for today will be Yukoi Gap, and um, I'll start back up hopefully tomorrow. So, yeah. Hey guys, so I took a zero in Hiawassee and I got off at Unicoi Gap. I did not do the miles that I was expecting and I feel well rested, got good rest and a bunch of food. So today my goal is to do at least five miles if I can, maybe do 10. And then I will be going to, um, going from there. And we're gonna see just how far today takes me. Um, we're supposed to get a little bit of rain, so that might change some things. But uh, I feel well rested, so hopefully I can bust out some miles. And uh, let's get this journey started.
So last night I stayed at Trey Mountain Shelter and today I'm hoping to make it 11 miles to Dix Creek Gap and I will be staying at Hostel hopefully if I can make it in time. Looks like we're going to get some rain and um, yeah it's hot but uh, kind of muggy so a lot of sweating today so who knows if I'll put on my rain jacket if I get cold only. So. See you guys down. For for first four thousand footer of the day, and then actually First and last for a 4,000 footer of the day. And I am beat. That took forever. And now I'm going downhill. I got about four miles to Dix Creek Gap where I'll be getting off for the day. Hey guys, I took uh, two zeros in Hiawassee, kind of got four texts in there. I am leaving, leaving from, from Dix Creek Gap and hopefully doing 11 miles and uh, getting to the um, muskrat shelter. Um, I took two zeros, let my body rest and also I avoided a bunch of rain so that's also very nice. And um, hopefully I'll be in Franklin and across the 100 mile mark in three days from now. So let's get the day started. One state down, too many more to go, <laughs> but at least I got one done. 
now I'm in North Carolina, finally out of Georgia. So, I have a few more miles to the shelter, but it's nice to have this accomplishment under my belt. And now off to the next state. What a view compared to earlier this morning with the heavy fog and cloud cover. It turned out to be a very nice day. So uh, last night I stayed at Muskrete Shelter and today I'm hoping to do about 16 miles and um, get to uh, Betty Creek um, Gap campsites. And uh, yeah, it was a good night, except for one dude yelling in the middle of the night, but oh well, at least I got some good rest. So let's get today going. I love these parts of this trail. When spring's starting just to pop up, and the trail's dark brown, and you got that crisp outline of greenery right before the trees pop, it's one of my favorite times to hike. So there's been some uh, recent bear activity at this uh, shelter. Hey guys, so last night I stayed at Carter Gap Shelter and there was reported bear activity, but I hung my bag and nothing happened to it over the night and neither did any of the other campers have any experiences with bears which I was kind of hoping for, so I could get some footage of a bear, but um, it just didn't happen. And, uh, but today, I'll be heading over Albert Mountain, which will mark the 100 mile uh, marker for the Appalachian Trail. And my goal is to do another 12 miles to the next shelter, and call it a day. So, yeah, let's get this day started.
Okay guys, just made it to the unofficial 100 mile mark. Uh, feels pretty good. can't believe I've actually already done 100 miles. And, uh, now I'm going to go do another 6 to the shelter. And I hope I can get there before uh, the sun sets. Thank you.